Connor Kuduna. Thanks for watching JMMS Student News. First up, we're going to Syria. We all know about the terrorist attacks that ISIS have committed over the past, but ISIS has taken most of the north side. ISIS has been terrorizing cities for about three to four years now and has become an imminent threat to the U.S. The rules state that any other religion that is not Islam shall be fought and killed. The Islamic State is one of the many rebel groups in Syria. So what's the Islamic State's role in Syria? ISIS is one of the many rebel armies battling the Syrian government for land. ISIS has been battling the Syrian government because of how the Syrian government has broken their rules. The Syrian government has been breaking the laws and now they are at war with many rebel groups. ISIS has almost complete control of, in the north of Syria and has been bombing all the cities below. Going to Dallas, Texas, we have a weather report from Gabby Cota and Hannah Roberts. When you have strong thunderstorms develop in the way they are fueled by the low pressure in the west and the warm air that shoots up from the Gulf of Mexico, once those twisters form, you have seen the damage that has been in its past. And now here's what to do during a tornado. When there's a tornado, you should always go to a bathroom or a basement. Always keep a flashlight and radio with you wherever you go so you can listen to where the tornado is located. Whenever there is a tornado, make sure you are always safe. Hannah Roberts. Yeah, we go to Next up, we have Colin with an update with the NBA. Colin? Hi, this is Colin, and today we will be talking about the most talented and skilled basketball team ever, the Oklahoma City Thunder. Currently, the Thunder are up 3-2 on the team with tons of bragging bandwagon fans, the Golden State Warriors. Honestly, the only reason they are so good is because of the refs' help. Commentators even let it slip sometimes of how the NBA likes to help them. But OKC is going to beat them because we hear yeah, they not? No, this is Ben Colin. Okay, bye. All around the world, school lunches have always been an issue with students. Throughout Jalissa and Aliyah reporting from James Madison. Recently at JMS, a number of students have pulled a survey about school lunches. Among the students, 58% of them responded that they sometimes like school lunch. 40% said they do like it, while the remaining students responded that they don't like school lunches. Do you feel like having seen lunch options every day will affect you? Well, about 68% of the students sometimes care about having the same school lunches. It's understandable that having the same lunches may be irritating and not healthy at the same time. Some students may think the opposite. The school lunch survey resulted in half of the students saying they take school lunch because they don't have anything to bring from home. More than half of the students who polled in the school lunch survey <laughs> responded that having more healthier lunch options will make school lunch better. Students are striving to help and create a better and healthier school lunch. All the way to Madison Middle School, we're calling out from Expedition, Mr. Ross. Also on Expedition, we have Mr. Tross from the principal's office, Mr. Torres. The Zika virus has become a huge breakout in Brazil and a huge threat that could be coming to North America. The Zika virus can be harmless to normal people that aren't pregnant, but if you are pregnant and you get the Zika virus, it could cause birth defects. Microcephaly is a birth defect where the baby's head is very small and has a learning disability. As you can see, the Zika virus is very dangerous. So how do we stop it from spreading to people? Pregnant women in America are being told not to travel to South America. Also use lots and lots of mosquito spray. This is what needs to happen before scientists find a key. Now look at this. This dog is tap dancing. The owner of this dog saw the dog was hungry and went and got a bag of food. When the owner came back, the dog started tap dancing. This corgi is apparently very hungry as you can see, and even hungry enough to start tap dancing. Apparently the dog loves the food more than its owner. ISIS is bad. <laughs> <Yeah>. No! <laughs> ISIS has been terrorizing cities for about three to four years now and has become an imminent threat to the U.S. The rules state that any other religion that is not Islam shall be fought and killed. The Islam- Matt! <laughs> you wreck- This is a tornado! <laughs> <laughs> Where's that car hang? <laughs> Hi, this is Colin, and today we will be talking about the most talented. <laughs> Gold State sucks! True!
bite you invertebrates. I'm gonna teach you how to do the sponge. Well, first you take your leg and you stick it in the air. And then you take the other one and jam it right up there. You twist yourself around and give a great big lunge. Now you're doing the sponge. I do the sponge, sponge. I do the sponge. Back your bunch of you in the sponge. Well, now that you take your leg, 